He's going to be driving an M3 competition with his name on it. Are you serious? My name's Andrew, and this is my new company car. Yeah. How are you going to make your car come on? <laughs> Mate, I had no idea. Okay, so let me tell you what's happening today. Andrew's the sales manager at Yanomize and he's been a friend of mine for a very, very long time. He drives an Astra and he has nothing but issues with it. Today is the day that I surprise him with an M3 competition. Now, this car used to belong to Bert, but as you guys know, Bert no longer works here. And today I've said to him, oh, the car needs to go back, can you drop me home? So I'm making him say a few words in front of camera and then he's gonna find out that the car is his. Let's get into it. Andrew, can I bro uh, borrow you? I think Jan wants you to drive the car. Okay. Yeah. Save the car. Yeah, it'll make it worse. Yeah. <laughs> like, just, just say this, Andrew, man. Yeah. So, just, just say this. You're like, this is my new company car. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I think you've got to take, I think you're taking this pack. I'm taking it back? Yeah. That's what Ian said. That's what Ian said. Oh. Yeah! So the plate you're seeing is Andreas. My son's called Andreas. Andrew's called Andreas, it's a Greek name, and due to the fact that my son's 15, he can't drive till he's 17, I'm gonna let him have that on his car as well. So he's gonna be driving an M3 competition with his name on it. It's going to be real cool, I'm really excited for him and it's going to be special. As I said, I've known him for, I don't even know, 20 years maybe. He's a fantastic member of staff and this, this is just going to be incredible for him. I'm really excited for him. I think it's going to be great for him to take home on the weekend. It's Friday today and he's got no idea, like absolutely no idea. And, and throughout this week, he's like, said, no, I can have it, Jan. Come on, Jan, you got like, can I not have it? I'll pay half, I'll do this, I'll do it. I'm like, Andrew, and I've been quite rude and abrupt with it as well. I'm like, no, listen, it has to go back. What about insurance? What about this? What about then? He's like, okay, then. <laughs> I'll be really bad, I feel bad. But anyway, Nom's gonna do that. Just to say, this is just obviously for visual, for Andrew to be able to see it. We're gonna make proper front and rear plates to be put on the car, which you'll see shortly. If you haven't seen where we've done the previous prank, me and Elliot shot a prank with Daniel, if you click here, where we pranked him that his Rolls Royce for Rafe had got stolen. Right, so we're ready. Andrew's at the front. My plan is to make him deliver a couple of lines. I'm gonna still act a little bit moody like I have been for the whole week, and then he's gonna be surprised. Okay. Because I need to... Uh, so what, what do you want me to say? Just be... Um, I know we're gonna have a conversation. Well, no, you're, you're, gonna, you're, gonna, you're gonna drop me back. Yeah. So we're gonna be like, okay, last drive in the car, blah, blah, blah. Have you driven this before? Uh, yes. Okay, cool. Uh, no, I haven't actually. Right, so this is Bert's company car. It is heading back to BMW Park Lane. We always get our cars from BMW Park Lane. Yeah. We've got a great relationship with them. Uh, we've wrapped many cars over the years with them. Yeah. They are... Would you say you're a brand ambassador for them? Yeah, I think a brand ambassador is probably a good word. The relationship's been with us for many, many years now. Bert did used to have this car. Obviously, he's left now, so the car's going to head back. Andrew's going to drive me to my house, I can pick up the Urus, and then they're going to come and pick up the car today, okay. I think. Um, do you need to say that you need to do three videos for them? You don't need to say that, do you? No, we've done two, haven't we? We've definitely done two. Yeah, we've done two. So this, this, is the this is the final video, I know, but I had to... All right, so i just get Andrew to say... Yeah, yeah. All right, say this then, say... Um... Introduce yourself so that we know. All right, so just be like, I'm Andrew, and this is my new company car. Are you serious? Are you serious? My name's Andrew, and this is my new company car. Oh, oh.
Cheers, bro. Oh, you can make me cry, come on. <laughs> Thank you. I've never seen him go this red. Thank you, man. Thanks. No, I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. One more thing. As, as like a little extra, okay, get him crying. And as a little extra from me, just um, why you've got the car, yeah. it would only be right. Just, just, look at, just look at the front. It'd only be right. Oh. And that's on the car now, yeah? I've already done it. Have you? So I've already insured it. I've already transferred it to the car. Hold on, isn't that Andrew's? Your it's Andrew. my son's plate. So that way, he's not still 17, so you might as well have it on your car why you've got the car. So at least you can drive around with your plate on the car. You've got your new company car. <laughs> so we've been gearing this up for the last week. So me and Gus went out. We filmed your car as we went around the, um, the COVID road. <laughs> we had to make sure it was your car because we wasn't sure if it was your car. Um, and all week I've been telling them, Andrew's like, is there no way I can have the car? Can I not pay half? Like, like, and I'm like, and I've been quite rude, haven't I? I've been like, no, it's insurance. I've been proper rude to him this whole week. I'm like, no, the insurance, the car's got to go back, Andrew. Like, you can't have the car. I haven't offered to pay for it. The way we do our deals with BMW Park Lane, because they're great, they give us deals for 12 months. Um, and we get fantastic VIP deals with them. So this goes back, I think, I think it's been seven months, and I think there's five months left. Next month, you'll be able to spec your new car as well. And you can choose whatever car you want. So if you want an X5, an X6, a 7 Series, a 6 Series, another M3, an M2, our chances are you're going to probably go for a Jeep, I assume. I'm not sure, nah. Why do I feel like one of these? <laughs> um, so just need you to take me home so I can have my own car now, please, if that's all right, if you don't mind. Cool. Yeah. Anytime. If anyone's watching, I've got a 62 plate Astra for sale. <laughs> Great mileage. But before we leave, do you want to say your line, please? Uh, my name's Andrew, uh, and this is my new car. <laughs> Bruv, you went Vauxhall Astra to M3 Cobb. Nico, Nico, went, Nico went Honda Type R to, to GTR. Mark went Honda Type R to uh, uh, S5 and then R8. Kian went birth Lambo. <laughs> <laughs> Just with your with your name on the car, bro. People are like, are you taking the standard? Like, you, but the more you like press Yan on something, it puts him off. Like it's got to be earned type thing. If, if you don't put me under pressure and you don't push me for something, I'd rather give it to you based on what I see, work ethic, attitude. But when someone's like, oh, can I have a pay rise or can I have this? I can have. It works totally against me. Hopefully over the last four and a half years, I've got, like, applied myself correctly to Yan. Um, yeah, I guess I have. So. Yeah. Right. <sighs> Take me home, chauffeur. Let's go. <laughs> Take me home, chauffeur. <laughs> right, we'll see you lot in a bit. <sighs> Bro, thank you, honestly. Like, you know what I'm like. I'm, know, I'm so grateful for this. I know you are. Let's go. I don't know why I'm driving 10 and 2 because I never drive like that. <laughs> I was thinking, but all of a sudden, all of a sudden, now you're a driving instructor. Did no one say, did, so you obviously had no idea, yeah? Mate, I had no idea. And so people were saying to you, bro, is Jan really not going to give you the car? No, to be fair, no, no one no one's really spoke about the car. Um, the only people that really spoke about it was like us and like Bert and that. And when I kind of said it the other day, I was like, oh, are you really giving the car away? Because, you know, the, the brand deal we have with with BMW is so good. Yeah. Um, it was like a no-brainer to kind of, even if, and I, said, I think I said it to you last night, even if it wasn't for me, even like for you, for Steph, it's it's such a great deal. Um, that would be like madness to give the car back. Look at this guy nodding at you. Yeah, thumbs up with the car. <laughs> oh, you're so famous, look at you. Balling out. Like, part, again, part of like my mindset is, um, you know, I'm, I'm, I think you're similar to me. Like I'm, I'm into like, manifesting stuff and and you know working towards a goal you can't just kind of like say oh i want a lamborghini and then think it's going to land on your doorstep but you know you i put things into the universe i work hard and now it just shows that it, it kind of does work and you do get rewarded obviously steph knew 
Yeah, of course, Stephanie. Yeah, yeah, yeah Stephanie, Stephanie. Yeah. So obviously it was here. She's like, why is the M3 here? I'm like, I'm just keeping it away from Andrew. <laughs> I just don't want him to know that he's got the car. Download the petrol app. Because that's going to be expensive. Don't worry, bro. You don't care, yeah, about the petrol? Yeah, okay, bro. Thank you so much. <laughs> I'll see you back at the office. Cool, bro. Enjoy, bro. Thank you, mate.